Hey, what's up everyone? Let me hop on here to do a quick review of the GE Profile Over the Range Microwave model. Uh, this here, I wanna say is a five, maybe a seven year update. I've had this here, we've had this microwave for quite some time, and I can tell you it is one of the, probably the best microwave that we've, uh, that we've ever bought. Uh, first off, inside, it's very, uh, everything here is very easy to clean. It has this nice, this nice black interior, um, hides, actually hides a lot of stuff really, really well, but it is very easy to wipe off. You do have the, you do have the turntable, uh, with the glass plate that comes off. Again, it makes it very, very easy to clean. Uh, in terms of size, as you can see, this is a fairly large microwave. You can fit, uh, some pretty large meals in here. And, uh, since it isn't over the range, it's, uh, they allow you to get them a little bit wider than the countertop models. Uh, it takes up a little bit, takes up more space than a countertop, but you can also get bigger stuff in there as well. Over here on the features, I like about this is this is a very, uh, it's a very convenient microwave. So basically what you're gonna do, put your food in there, you're gonna hit the cook time, and then over here the dial, you just kind of dial in to your, to however long you want it to go. And you'll, you'll kind of feel that it clicks. I don't know if you can hear it on video. You'll hear those clicks. Each click is 15 seconds that you can go in. Then you basically just hit your, push it in like a button and it will actually start going. Uh, and then as far as you've got your add 30 second button, you can just add 30 seconds off the, uh, without actually having to hit the start or the cook time button. And then it also has the same sensor, the popcorn beverage uh, reheat or defrost. I can say the popcorn sensor cook is spot on. I don't think I ever, I rarely ever have an unpopped kernel or burnt popcorn when I use the sensor. GE's got this one here really dialed in. And uh, because it is an over the range model, you also have a really good vent fan. As you can hear that, it actually does vent out the top and there are little filters in there that remove all the grease and particulates out of it before, uh, before the fan is done. Turn that off, you've actually got another um, an LED surface light, which again will light up your range that you're on there. That, you actually got two, two brightness settings and then again, there's just the, the filter to let you know when the filters actually uh, need replacing. Overall, it's a very, uh, very well-built microwave. It's a quality microwave. I have not seen a performance drop off in the years that we've owned it, and um, it does get a lot of use. So definitely a quality unit, and I do recommend this if you're in the market for a, uh, for a microwave. Hey, real quick, if you like what you see in this video and you want to purchase one for yourself, I've left links to everything here in the description. And if you want more no-nonsense, no-BS product reviews, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel and hit the, uh, hit the bell so you don't miss one.